What's up guys, this is Kyle Sword and Simon coming to another video. If you're wondering why I'm wearing the same clothing pieces as my previous videos, because I'm recording another video, two videos in the same day just to get more content out to you guys. So today's video is going to be on a different product than I usually go over in my videos. Today we're going to be talking about these two dope phone cases right here. So some of you might not know, but I personally use the iPhone 6s right here, iPhone 6s. Before this I had the iPhone 6 until that got messed up and so I just upgraded to the 6s right here. So yeah, for the longest time I've been using uh, Solaris iPhone cases. We don't know what Solaris is. I, I don't know if it's like in multiple, multiple malls, but it's like this little, um, booth thing that's in my local mall, Walt Whitman Mall. They have this like uh, iPhone case area, little booth thing, uh, kiosk, I think that's what it's called, I don't know, called Solaris. They make multiple cases for multiple types of phones and it's like basically the same type of phone case that I've been getting. The one that's like a thin double layer case with like a rubber thing that goes over the phone first and then a hard shell that goes over it. I've been using that for the longest time and they just keep end up breaking eventually and so my last case that I was using was uh, that kind of case, as you can see, it's broken. But yeah, so it's like this rubber piece that goes over the phone. Actually, let me just show you guys. See, it's like a rubber piece that goes over the phone, and then you, like, put that on, this is the back of it, and then this was the front of it until it, like, snapped multiple times. I'm not sure if you could see that. But yeah, this was the case that I was using before. I actually got a lot of compliments on it. This, as you can see, is a Benjamin Franklin $100 bill case right here. And yeah, actually, I thought this was really fresh. It was like the only one that they really had at the booth that I liked. And it just slowly, slowly ended up breaking. And I was like using it for the longest time. And eventually there was just no chance for me using it anymore. So I went online to um, redbubble.com. I don't know if you ever heard of them, but it's a website basically where you can basically get so many different prints, logos, cool photograph pictures on basically everything iPhone, like basically any type of device case. They have pillows, posters, blankets, uh, all types of shit. And see, I've been looking on their site for a long time. They have some really dope iPhone cases. Like if you just go on the website and type in Kanye West, you'll get like at least 200 different iPhone cases. Some not even related to Kanye West, like maybe Travis Scott or Columbus or whatever. But they have a lot, a lot of options. Anyway, so I just ended up pulling the trigger and bought two cases. Before we get into the actual cases, I just want to acknowledge the packaging that these came in. I just really love how these came in from Redbubble. So I ordered directly from the website and it took like, I'd say about a week or two to come in. It, it wasn't that bad. But this, these are the boxes that they come in. A little focus, there you go. And these are really dope. It has all kinds of prints over them. It's very, very modern. I really like it. There's like some cardboard with some cool prints on it. And as you can see on the bottom right there, it says Red Bubble. And you just pulled like the little cardboard and it opens up like so. You can see, it opens up and your case is in here. It kind of looks like a cassette tape or something. I don't know, it's just what it looks like to me. Your phone case is in there and it just comes out. I just really. Really like the packaging came in. Both of them came like that, as you could see. And also, it did come with a sticker, as you can see right here. Nice red bubble sticker. I hadn't put this on anything because it's kind of big for my laptop. My laptop has a bunch of stickers on it. And so, I might put it on a future uh, boosted board, possibly, maybe. As you saw from the title, these are two Hype Beast cases right here. And I love both of these. I've only been really using one of them so far because one of them is white. But I'll go over the white one first. And as you can see right here, we have a Drake OVO inspired case right here. There you go, it's in focus. As you can see, it's a glossy white case with the uh, six god uh, prayer hands right here and this really cool like, I don't know if you can see it, but it's kind of like a rainbowy on the um, like negative shadows of the hands right there. There you go with a close up of it. I'm sorry if there's like some reflections, just a really reflective case right here. But yeah, as you can see, it's like kind of a rainbowy kind of like a CD kind of effect on the um, shadows of the hands. And when I first saw that on the website, I thought it was maybe like a metallic where it like if you turned it multiple times, it like changed colors. But no, it's just like a printed kind of effect right there. And it still looks dope in my opinion. But yeah, so both these cases are the same model. I believe these are their, um, there's like three different kinds you, kinds you can get. You can get like the skinny and then I think there's the tough. Or I believe it's called the tough. I'll, I'll write it right here if I'm wrong. But yeah, these are the protective cases right here. It has a plastic outside, as you can see, 
and it has another layer, uh, which is this black part right here. It's it's kind of like the old the other case that I was using, but it's much much stiffer. It doesn't I don't, doesn't really come out. I mean, it does. I don't know if you can see that, but I never really take it apart like that. But that's the inside right there. It's like a matte black plastic, and that is the bottom of the case. You have all your port holes for your uh, charging port, headphone jack, and speaker. On the side, you got some rubber for your power button, and on the other side, you got your uh, little hole for the mute switch and the your vol and your volume button. So basically, that's it for this case right here. Very simple, white black with your prayer hands right there. I just love this. Shouts out to Drake. And yeah, I actually haven't put my phone in this case yet because it's white and I don't really want to get it messed up. I'll probably use it eventually, just haven't really used it yet. But the next case I'm going to show you guys, I've been using for like basically every day since I've got these cases and I just love it so much. This is basically the reason why this video is titled Hype Beast Cases. Bam. Wait, got uh, focus. There you go. Okay, so this, as you can see, is basically a Hypebeast case right here. The only way this can get more Hypebeast is if you got some Supreme logos on there. And actually, they have a bunch of stuff on the website with like Supreme logos, Bape Camo, and these Comme des Constant parts right there. I don't know if I said that wrong, but yeah, that was our, the brands right there. But yeah, with this specific case, this is a, obviously a combination of two really well-known brands. You got the... Uh, original green ba a bathing ape camo in the background and you got multiple common de on play hearts as you can see I don't own anything from either of these brands because they're both Retardedly expensive, but as soon as I saw this on the website. I had to pick it up It's just so dope and it just looks great when my phone's in and I actually let me show you guys right here My only complaint with these cases and it's not only like, it, is, it is a complaint But I guess it's a good thing is that it's kind of really hard to put your kit your phone in the case and take your phone out of it because it doesn't really flex much and I kind of need to like really force it in there to get it but as soon as you it's a lot easier to get it in the case than out of but yeah here it is right here this is what it looks like your phone is in there and I personally love how this case looks as you can see right here you know back when the iPhone 6 first came out and everyone was talking about how it's gonna like bend on you and you shouldn't buy it because like people did a bunch of bend tests on it and no one's really been talking about that recently but that's kind of how I feel whenever I'm taking my phone out of this case because you really gotta force the case back to get the phone out and so yeah I got the phone out right here finally got the phone in and so yeah as you can see right here if that'll focus got the prayer hands case right here loving it iPhone 6s hello but yeah for now I'm gonna be rocking my phone in the common deck on and bait camo case right here, iPhone success, just love it. So let's go kind of wrap up this video guys. If you wanna follow me in my social medias down below, links will be in the description. If you can follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, ViscoCam, Snups, and Beam. If you haven't already, make sure to check out my last two Kanye West related videos. I got the video on the 750s and also on Kanye's San Pablo tour. So I'll put links in the description to both of those videos if you haven't checked it out already. And yeah, so I'm going to get out of here, guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure to hit that like button if you haven't already. And I'll catch you in the next one. See you guys for 17. Signing out. Peace.